This is how we represent a neutrino. The particle itself is a fundamental particle and is too small to be seen by any imaginable instrument of observation. So we instead represent the property that allows the neutrino to interact. The white area represents the weak charge of the neutrino. This charge, entirely separate of electric charge, gives rise to the weak nuclear force. This force allows the neutrino to interact, but only very weakly and its typical range is much smaller than the diameter of a proton. Neutrinos are produced when a down quark decays into an up quark and an electron. Conservation laws require that a tiny neutral particle is created in beta decay. And the particle is the neutrino. Well, technically, it's an anti-neutrino. Because the neutrino only interacts through weak force and negligible gravity, it almost never interacts with other particles on its own. Millions of neutrinos stream through your body every second, totally unnoticed and unnoticeable. 